The Open Championship tees off this Thursday, so let's run through my favorite options on FanDuel for this week in each salary tier. In the upper range for tournaments, I want to go Justin Thomas. For cash games, your guy is Rory McIlroy, but I think that for tournaments, there is room to deviate to either Scotty Scheffler or JT. As far as JT goes... He had a rough outing last week, but he's still golfing really well overall. Thomas ranks 10th in distance gained across the past 50 rounds, according to Fantasy National. He is 7th in approach and 30th in putting as well. And of course, we know JT can rise at this kind of event. He did win the PGA Championship. He finished 3rd at the... RBC Canadian Open as well. So sure, JT struggled last week. And sure, McElroy is a better play for cash games. But Scheffler is right there. JT is right there. I think you've got room to deviate for tournaments if you want a lower roster rate at the top end of your lineup. So to me, Justin Thomas, a quality play for tournaments this week on FanDuel. In the mid-range, I love Sam Burns at $10,100. Burns, like JT, has struggled this past two events, but the longer-term form is still very good. Burns ranks 21st in distance gain the past 50 rounds, 13th in approach, and 4th in putting. Really good putter for Sam Burns, and that does include a pair of wins and a 4th place finish in that time. We saw Burns miss the cut at the Masters, but he was 20th at the PGA Championship, 27th at the U.S. Open, and the salary's down to $10,100. I think this is a good buy-low spot and a very good golfer and someone who does round out the mid-range very well at $10,100. As far as value plays go for this week, I love adore Max Homa at $9,000, just too low for how good he is golfing right now. And I think that Homa is a primary core play for this week. Homa ranks 12th in Data Golf's true strokes gained across the past six months. And he's made the cut in all three majors so far this, this, this calendar year. We saw Homa finish 13th at the PGA Championship and 13th at the Players as well, so he can do well against good fields. He was 5th at the Memorial in addition to a win he has in 2022 as well. Homa is another guy with good distance off the tee. He ranks 29th there across the past 50 rounds while ranking 21st in approach and 12th in putting. I just think Homa is under salary. So if you want a core play for this week in the low range, Max Homa is your guy at just $9,000. That's all we got here for this week for the Open Championship and this major season for the PGA Tour. Good luck to you for this week. We'll talk to you once again soon here on the FanDuel Hurry Up. 